Jonah! <laughs> you look terrible. Terrible, but happy. I was right, Jonah. Dad was right. The divine source is real. I wish he was here to see this. He'd be proud of you. Sophia told me what you've done for her people. Lara, it's good to see you, Sophia. Jacob is waiting for you in the observatory. You actually found it. The founders of Katesh were skilled craftsmen. They used this place to you the Atlas. <sighs> Jonah, try those chains. Got it. have used this to plan the construction of the city. Like ancient blueprints. Exactly. Everything radiates out from this point. That puts the center of the city under the lake. But, hmm, something's not right. The cathedral, where the atlas was, it's on the wrong side of the map. Keep rotating it. Katesh isn't under the lake. It's under the glacier. The divine source must be there. How the hell are we gonna get through all that ice? Wait. This path here leads into the city. The cathedral is there. And the tower on the other side. That means the entrance to Katesh must be... Here. The entrance to Katesh is here. You knew. before Trinity discovers the location of the source. But I have to go after Jonah. Even if it means giving up the truth you came here to find. He risked his life to come here with me. I almost lost him once. Not again. Then go. Do what you must.
If Jonah is alive, they must be holding him in the old Soviet gulag. I never wanted to go back to that terrible place, but I can't leave him in Trinity's hands now. Joan, hold on. Sophia, are you there? Laura! Are you alright? I'm up by the old copper mill overlooking the gulag. I'm about to go in after Jonah. I know the spot. We hit a stash of weapons near where we first attacked Trinity. You might find them useful. Thank you, Sophia. I'll see you when I get out. saw you, you were... Damn it, Laura. You better not be dead. After the avalanche, I... I got one little blip. One brief echo. But I'll be damned if it wasn't your voice. I know I heard it. I know you survived. At least the avalanche. I haven't heard a peep since, but I'll keep trying. I know you told me to leave, to get somewhere safe, but... Did you really expect me to leave you here? Come on. You should know me better than that. More propaganda.
know I've spoken little of your mother, Lara, but I want you to know that in the brief time she spent with you, she loved you utterly. We were a very happy little trio, and when we lost her, I was a wreck. I still am. I hope one day I will find answers that will stop this pain. For me it is too late, but for others, maybe not. <laughs> I'm rambling now. I shouldn't have had that nightcap. <laughs> Sweet dreams, dearest. Was it all about her? Those questions about life you hoped to answer? Or was that just an excuse? Maybe I reminded you of her too much. God, Lara, you're talking to a ghost. About another ghost. <sighs> Maybe you need a nightcap. I don't know if you're reading me, Lara, but I'm going to keep trying. Something's out here. I climbed a tree to get a better view of the valley below. I can see old buildings and some activity. Looks like they got choppers, and they're bringing in all kinds of equipment. It's gotta be Trinity. It's the only explanation. <sighs> Looks like they beat us at the punch after all, huh? I've been watching for the past few hours, taking notes of their patrols. I think I can slip by them, if I time it right. You are always better than me at this. If you're out there, and you can hear me, please, be careful. to find shelter. I should never have doubted you, Dad. I wasn't there when you needed me most. I'm sorry. I'll make them see that you were right all along. That you sought the truth, not fairy tales. I'll make it right, Dad. I promise. Lara, it's time. John is waiting. Joan.
Jonah must be up there somewhere. Extraordinary. The Divine Source. It's in the center of the old city, buried beneath the ice. Then it's time to move. I will notify the dig teams and prepare the transports. Our men encountered the Deathless Ones in the Archive. This will not be easy, brother. The Holy Path is not meant to be easy. Are the men aware of what they will face? No. But they are prepared to fight and to die for the cause. That's all we need from them. Constantine, now that we're so close to the end... We've only just begun. I'm afraid Trinity is just using us. What if they don't intend to let you keep the source? We should prepare No! You must have faith. I wasn't chosen by Trinity. Once the source is mine, it won't matter what they want. I will lead God's immortal army. And you... You shall live. The prisoner is awake and ready for questioning. I'm on my way. Tracks. Damn, they're everywhere. Hold your fire, just a deer. Ichi trigger. Finger, sorry. You saw movement and reacted. I would have done the same. was too heavy, and the bridge collapsed. Everything's falling apart in this place. Should we call it in? Don't bother. Everyone's packing up and getting ready to move out. Good. We finally get what we came for. Hard to say. Ugh. 
What happened back there? Bridge collapsed. Looks like we're gonna have to fly out the rest of the cargo. Grenade! 
Hmm, an old Soviet plaque. Anna must be close. It's a stamp to seal official Trinity letters. Not many people still use these. Crews are already... Hey, give me a hand over here. Sure, hold on. What's up? This damn truck is dead. Don't bother. We're not taking any of this shit with us when we leave. Uh, suppose you're right.
We stand now on the very cusp of a new world. The divine source has been located. Croft, while still alive, has been effectively neutralized. But Anna grows weaker by the hour. Her voice... That voice I've known my whole life is starting to falter. I asked her if she remembers that night. The first night that God carved purpose into my hands. The night that he chose me. She said she did. And then she smiled and said that we would have nights again like that. Once this ordeal is over, for her, I stay strong. In the old city, we will find the divine source. I will save my sister, and together, we will save this world from itself. A pendant? No. A modern reliquary. There's a small human bone inside. Saint Peregrine, patron of the terminally ill. A rifle shell, but there's something unusual about this one. Latin engraving on the end. Kill them all. God will know his own. I won't die in this godforsaken valley. My faith is strong. My will is strong. Even if my mind keeps wandering away. In our youth, Constantine and I in our youth, he, he was a difficult child. Always wondering, always questioning, afraid of what the future might hold. Afraid that he might never find his purpose. The night I cut those marks into his hands. The night I whispered into his ear. I made him. I saved him. He believed it to be the work of God. Just as I'd hoped. Now I need him to save me. And if in the end he can't, then I'll save myself. Got up close this time. Figured when I find you, maybe I'll have learned something that'll help. Here's what I know. There's an operation here. Something big. 
Hundreds of nasty-looking soldiers. No insignia, no nothing. All holed up in this old Russian facility. Looks like it was once one of those awful gulag prisons. I came down here thinking you needed me, Lara, but... Christ, how backwards is that? Before too long, I might be the one who needs rescuing. phase of the operation. Just get prepped to me. Oh shit! Over here!
Your loyalty to her is strong. I admire you. I do. But even my patience has limits. Tell me what you know. Now! Please, please, no. Don't listen to him! I was only doing what I believed was right. No! Uh. <laughs> Sweep the cell blocks. Kill everyone. I should have killed him, but he was unarmed. I just couldn't. Shh. You shouldn't have to. I am so sorry for getting you into this mess. <coughs> I thought I could keep up. They're coming. We're surrounded. This time I've got your back. He's dying. We don't have much time. Bar the door. All units respond. We've got to deal with her. We're almost in position. I know that you like to read the archaeological journals now, but I urge you that if you see anything written which is less than pleasant about me, to ignore it. There are those who simply do not understand the work I'm doing here. Perhaps they're even frightened by it, but their fear and stupidity is not my concern, and neither should it be yours. I will explain everything in good time, my darling girl. The people that were frightened, were they Trinity? You never told me. I guess it doesn't matter now anyway. They found their way to me. Now I'm going to have to deal with them.